Hi, my name is Christian from Hopefully Useful Software. Today I'm going to show you version 2 of Simple Songwriter, our fun and incredibly useful application for creating new song ideas or working out the chords of existing songs. Here's the main chord screen. The chord groups are based on the circle of fifths. So on the left we have the major chords, in the middle the minor chords, and on the right extra chords. The modifier section on the right allows you to play inversions and sevenths of each of these chords. Most pop and rock songs are based around these chord groups. Here's an example of a song you might know. When you're ready to record a song of your own, press the record button, choose your options, and click start. If the metronome is ticking too quickly for you, click on the settings button, and then drag up or down to your desired tempo. Then click stop, and start from the beginning. stop button to finish recording, click play to hear it back. You can change the key of your song by clicking the key button and then selecting a different key. Choose flats or sharps. Click play to hear the song back. To see a list of your chords, click the Song Chords button. Here, since I chose the quantize option, I am allowed to adjust each of the steps. I can see that I can see that this chord is slightly out of time, so I'm going to move it back in time by one step. That should make it sound a little better. Also, I would like to change the chord second section to an inversion. Let's see what that sounds like. The song chord section allows you to edit sounds after recording and get the exact progression you'd like. When you're happy with your song, click the load save button and choose save current song. And click the done button. Your song is now saved. Likewise, when you want to load a song that you've saved, click the load save button again and choose it from the list. If in the chord section you'd prefer the modifiers to be on the left hand side, go to the settings and change the modifier location. Audio recording is also possible on microphone enabled devices. Simply go to the record section and enable it on the audio segmented control.
that covers the basics. If you want to know more, check our website, or if you have any questions, send us an email. Thanks a lot.